hello guys i'm back with making videos and in case you don't know me don't subscribe to this channel it's horrible don't at any circumstance subscribe to this channel but anyway so honestly i wanted to make a video on uh, the sins of reboot like my thoughts on it and volition were like <laughs> this guy's gonna make a video in in december or something let's just shut down the whole studio so you can make a video on it so yeah honestly i haven't finished the sins of reboot yet but I just want to show my thoughts on the recent Sinjo news, Volition shutting down, Deep Silver taking the blame for it, and uh, my thoughts on the Sinjo reboot, which some of y'all have, have been waiting like a lot for me to talk about the Sinjo reboot. I've been joking here and there about the reboot, but overall, to take this down, I don't like the reboot. Congrats! I have an opinion that, like... 99% of the sins of community has let's go let's go let's go let's go but yeah um let's talk about the sins of reboot first so me i played this game in like january uh me i honestly haven't bought the game on epic i had this guy from my town who had like the collections edition or something it was like yo man i'm gonna give it to you for three dollars and i was like three dollars that's real that's that's real estate so i i, I bought the let me show it to you guys. So, uh, like, this is what I got. PC, and it was $3 back in December, I believe, of last year. I got the Notorious Edition for $3 and something like that. Like, actually, no cab, bro. He, he, he tried so hard to sell it, and the best price he got for it was $3 and a half or something. So, I bought the, defend, the Notorious Edition of Saints Row. And me being a hater as I am, I still pirate the game to play it. I played like five missions from January to it's September, just to, to let you guys know. And uh, the game fucking sucks, man. I don't like to curse, but the game fucking sucks, bro. And um, yeah, that was my whole opinion. I'm not going to review the game since I haven't finished it, but this game fucking sucks ass, bro. It has some nice things here and there, which I should make a list because there's only two or three things that I liked. There's that. So, yeah, let's get into the recent news. Volition shut down. 30 years of work. 30 years of Volition. And they've been shut down. They left us. Now, this is some sad news, honestly. And let me tell you why it's sad news. You know me. Ever since the boy got from Deep Silver, your boy has been hating on Deep Silver like a motherfucker. And uh, it just came out to, to the news that the direction that the Sinjo reboot had was initially going to be like a Sinjo 2.5 with the vibe of, of Sinjo 2 and Sinjo the 3rd, somewhere there in between. And goddamn, I've been making videos saying that for like five years now. And uh, yeah, that was the direction they were going for until Deep Silver stepped in and were like, man. Why give the fans what they want? Let's make the woke game ever made. The wokest game ever made. Fuck Volition. And uh, yeah. It's honestly... <laughs> it's kind of not surprising. Because I know Deep Sivers are... Are bad. Are bad. And... Um, yeah, Deep Silver is the reason why the Sinjo reboot got the stake it had. And that just says a lot about Deep Silver as a company. And it also says something about Volition, because Volition, rest in peace, Idol Ninja, they knew what the community wanted. And they got lowballed. They got played by their publishers to change the direction of the game. Now, I don't know why Volition would have stepped in and not give the fans what they wanted. There's YouTubers who's gonna make videos on that later. And they install sort of stuff. But honestly, it sucks to see how the community was just being shitted on. And let not let's not get me started on the new boy, on the new fans of the Sinjo reboot ever since it got revealed, who were ranting, hating, boycotting, uh destroying people who had a bad opinion about the game before the release. Then the game released, they went quiet. Then Volition shut down, and there would have been something like, man, 
Volition shut down because they, because they made so much profit of the sensory reboot. Shut your bitch's mouth, bro. So, uh, yes, this is my final sensory reboot video. Uh, I, oh, I haven't covered the DLCs because I haven't played them. The DLCs fucking suck, even though I haven't played them. I've seen what they're like. Like, come on, make an expansion that's worth 30 minutes of you playing it to finish it. This fucking sucks, man. What the fuck is the community up to, bro? What the fuck is gaming has become, bro? So, uh, yeah. Honestly, I feel bad for bullying Volition a bit. Like, I, I did that in the past. And... Nothing I regret. I don't regret nothing in life. But me bullying them and them shutting down, it's... Um, it feels weird. So yeah, this is my take on the Sins reboot. It sucks. This is my take on the latest news that Evolution got shut down because of Deep Silver and their take on the fucking Sins reboot to make such a miserable piece of shit. And uh Bro, I just want Sins back and uh with this kind of news it seems like it won't happen anytime soon, honestly. Evolution were great developers and besides that they were part of my childhood, honestly. Like, Sinjo 1, Sinjo 2, even Sinjo the 3rd. I even like Sinjo 4. Believe it or not. Even Get Out of Hell, I liked it. But the name in the coffin was the Sinjo reboot and their take on it. So, uh, because Deep Silver interfered with them, they were like, man, don't make Sinjo 2.5. Make fucking Sinjo minus 10 out of 10. I don't know, man. Something like that. So, yeah, guys, this is my take on this. Thank you for unsubscribing recently on my channel because honestly, I haven't posted that much. Sorry about that. I mean, I'm at university, even though it's summer, it was summer. I'm just a busy person, you know how it is. Um, so, if you, my fans, watch this video, I'm gonna make more content. If you're new to the channel, I hope you enjoyed what I said. I dare you to subscribe. You won't be able to do it. Once you press subscribe on this channel, your standards will lower in life. And uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching and Deep Silver can suck a dick.